Meanwhile, the aviation industry is set to experience a total shutdown on Tuesday as unions threaten to carry out a strike. Ocheme Abad, a general secretary, National Union Air Transport Employees, and Francis Akijole, general secretary, Air Transport Services, maintained that the second day of the ongoing strike would be more effective than the first day. Conditions of service for some of the agencies uh, which had been gone through due process, uh, some of them for up to 13 years, have been lying uh, fallow at the Salaries and Wages Commission and the Office of the Head of uh, Civil Service of the Federation. And uh, all efforts, including by the Ministers of Aviation and Minister of Labor, have all failed to achieve the desired uh, result. Part of the demands in 2019 when we threatened to shut down. But we shielded our, our assurance then. We didn't do anything because they assured us that everything was going to become normal by March end of that year. Look at where we are now. Still asking for the same thing. I mean, they are still the same demands that we have been fighting for all these years. Except for one that is just creeping in, which is the demolition. The threat to demolish the headquarters of the agencies in Lagos just because they want to relocate everybody to Abuja. Passengers were earlier stranded at the airports as flights were cancelled due to the protests. I agreed to travel by Arik 1040 flight this morning. I was coming from Amu, I knew that there was a lot of hold up in the Kenya. We've been coming, trying to wriggle out. But getting here now is just that the old place is stuck up. My house have to drop me on the bridge, I have to be trekking down to the airport just to find this kind of uh, labor unrest come out. So I'm still wondering whether we could fly today or not. International airport to this point, I am now, took me like one hour for something minutes. A distance of like, uh, almost like two kilometers, like 10 minutes drive. Took me one hour, close to two hours. Somebody woke up this morning to go for a business. To earn a living, you just stop the person somewhere. A movement of five minutes is not too. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.